Lastly, with Expandacraft here again, and we just finished testing the Vikita from E Propulsion Systems. And um, I want to tell you what we did. Now, if you come in close, this is a prototype, people. Expandacraft is not putting out product that looks like this. I cobbled this together in about a half an hour so that we could test this Vikita. Now, it looks small, but I am really, really impressed. Compared to the 55 pound thrust motor that I tested just the other day, this thing does the same speed. I got 4.8 miles per hour. I got four and a half, uh, almost five miles an hour against the wind. And it's probably blowing about six or eight knots uh, of wind. Um, sorry for mixing my knots and miles per hour, but Google it. Uh, so here's the thing. Uh, I'm really, really impressed with the thrust. Even at half throttle, I was getting uh, about two miles an hour, two, two and a half miles an hour. Uh, and that's where you're probably going to uh, get the, the, the best uh, range is about half throttle. Full throttle, you get a little bit of a splash because, I mean, five miles an hour is pretty quick on a boat like this, especially when it's choppy. So you get splash and that causes drag. So at half throttle, you'll get more than double the distance. The less speed, the longer distance you can go. Um, and you don't want to go fast, fast on a boat like this anyway. Um, give them your website. So it's www.annapolishybridmarine.com. And um, this thing retails for? $7.99 for the motor, the battery, the wrist throttle, and a variety of accessories that let you mount it in uh, different ways for different situations. This fitting, for example, turns upside down like this, and now you can strap it to a kayak. And this fitting lets you uh, mount it to a rudder, so then it becomes steerable. Well, speaking of rudders, uh, what I did with the, um, the other 12-volt, uh, 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 I can't even remember the manufacturer's name, but it's, it's got a steering mechanism on it. And I think what I would do is I would make this steerable as well. So I have steering in the front and steering in the back. Uh, because this is a 16 foot 9 inch expander craft. That's a long boat to turn if all you're relying on is the small prototype rudder that I have on there. So it needs a little bit bigger rudder or you need that front steering as well. And that, it turns like a sharp boat. Uh, the other thing that's just so good about this, so great about it, this is like 8 pounds people. 8 pounds. The motor alone uh, for the uh, 12 volter is like 28 pounds and then there's 30 something pound battery every pound that you're putting on is a pound of gear you can't so big big difference in the weight um, no difference in the speed the, the the 12 volt does the same speed as this uh, I was impressed thank you for letting us uh, try this out on the expand the craft uh, for more uh, go to the website because we're going to put a link I don't make any money on those uh, units. That's his thing. And then this is my thing. Expandacraft.com. And we just